इब्ने मर जाना ने चाहा था जिस सर को झुकाना ना रुका वो सर ना रुका उसका जिक्र गवाही देती है अर्ज बलाजवारों को देख कर के गुंबजे खूने खुदा ताबत पूछा रहेगा सर हुसैन का السلام علیکہ یا سار اللہ و ابن سار سلام بر حرم خون خدا لبائک یا حسین In the heart of Karbala, a sacred land where the echoes of his spirit resonates lies a shrine that carries the weight of a timeless legacy This is the Haram al-Khun al-Khuda the shrine of divine blood where the spirit of Imam Hussain alayhi salam lives on Imam Hussain al-Allah abdeen alayhi salam said The land of Karbala on the day of judgment shines like a pearl star and cries out that I am the holy land of God, the pure and blessed land that surrounds the leader of the Mars and the ruler of the youth of the paradise, Sayyid al-Shoda Imam Hussain alayhi salam. Upon hearing the news of Imam Hussain alayhi salam's martyrdom, residents from the town of Tawarij, the outskirts of Karbala, went towards Imam Hussain's shrine with the aim of answering his call. Almost around 1400 years later, millions of lovers of Imam Hussain replicate that one to show loyalty, love and devotion to the master of the Mahds on the 10th Muharram. As the pilgrims approach the shrine, their hearts beat in unison. Their voices rise and their souls become one. They chant Abad Wallah Ya Zahra Ma Ninsa Hussaina, a powerful invocation that reverberates through the air, reaching the heavens above. These words hold within them a sense of Imam Hussain's sacrifice, a testament to the unwavering devotion of his followers. They serve as a reminder that the message of Karbala is not confined to the distant past, but rather lives on. eternally engraved in the hearts of those who seek truth and justice has habib umar roz ghair o jan o bari ro muslim bkha labai cha ya hosen shod nawai ma pahme ye jan kar walai ma labai cha ya hosen shod nawai ma pahme ye jan زلت هی ها هی اتو بفلت هی ها شی او زلت هی ها هی اتو بفلت هی tears flow freely for the shrine is not just a place of remembrance it is site of profound connection with the sorrow and the grief of Imam Hussein's martyrdom find solace in the hearts of his followers these tears are not merely a symbol of sadness but a testament to the undying love and loyalty that binds the pilgrims to their beloved imam when i stand before the shrine of imam hussain i feel an overwhelming sense of peace and tranquility it is as if his noble spirit embraces me assuring me that i am not alone in this journey of life The chanting and running symbolize our unwavering commitment to never forget the sacrifice of Imam Hussain alayhi salam. It is a physical and a spiritual expression of our loyalty and love for him and for his family. This pilgrimage is not just a ritual. It is a transformative experience. It reminds us of our duty as a follower of Imam Hussain to stand against injustice and oppression in all its forms. The pilgrimage to the Haram al-Khun al-Khuda is a profound journey. of self discovery and renewal it ignites a fire within the hearts of pilgrims 
urging them to carry the message of Imam Hussain a.s. beyond the shrine's sacred walls as pilgrims bid farewell to the shrine. They carry with them a renewed commitment to embody the teachings of Imam Hussain a.s. in their everyday lives. They return to their communities as ambassadors of peace, justice and compassion, striving to create a world that reflects the ideals for which Imam Hussain sacrificed everything. Amidst the rituals of mourning and self-flagellation, the pilgrims seek to embody the pain and the suffering endured by Imam Hussain and his family and his companions. It is a sacred traces, a means to purify their souls and align themselves with noble principles for which their Imam stood. Yet, the commemoration at the Shrine of Divine Blood extends beyond the rituals of mourning. It is also a time of selfless giving and sacrifice. As pilgrims strive to emulate the compassion and the generosity of Imam Hussain, they offer food, water and shelter to fellow pilgrims and locals, embodying the spirit of humanity and unity. In the haram e khune khuda the Shrine of Divine Blood, is a testament to the enduring legacy of Imam Hussain. It stands as a beacon of hope, inspiring pilgrims to uphold the values of justice, compassion, and righteousness in their own lives. The Haram e Khune Khuda, the Shrine of Divine Blood, remains a sacred sanctuary that unites hearts, transcending boundaries of language, nationality, and culture. It is a testament to the timeless legacy of Imam Hussain alayhi salam, and a reminder that his message of love, sacrifice, and social justice continues to inspire and guide humanity. This journey has transformed my perspective on life. It has taught me the value of sacrifice, the strength of faith, and the power of unity. The Haram Khune Khuda serves as a powerful reminder that the principles Imam Hussain stood for justice, truth, and compassion are timeless and universal. It calls upon us to confront the injustice of our time, to champion the rights of the oppressed, and to strive for a world where the love and humanity prevail. Within the sacred walls of the shrine, pilgrims find solace and spiritual nourishment. They seek forgiveness, guidance, and blessings from Imam Hussain, knowing that his intercession holds the power to heal hearts and uplift souls. It is here that all the divine connection between the Imam and his follower is strengthened, transcending time and space. Stepping foot on the path from Imam Hussain salam, to Allah Abbas salam, shrine through Ben al Harman. And the taint of Muharram is a profound and awe-inspiring experience. As part of a sea of millions of faithful pilgrims, there is an overwhelming sense of unity and purpose, as if the collective heartbeat of devotion resonates through every step. Emotions run high as one becomes immersed in the atmosphere of reverence and love. Realizing the privilege of being part of a historic journey, it honors the sacred personalities of Imam Hussain and Labbas. It is a moment of deep spirituality and connection where the boundaries of individual identity dissolve and the pilgrims become part of a larger tapestry of faith, embarking on a pilgrimage that carries the weight of centuries of devotion. As we step into the sacred shrine of Al-Abbas on the day of Ashura, the tenth of Muharram, a profound realization dawns upon us. We are reminded of the unparalleled loyalty and unvarying faithfulness that Al-Abbas, the standard barrier of righteousness, displayed towards the family of Prophet Muhammad peace upon him. The air is filled with the sense of reverence and admiration for his sacrifice and devotion. 
chanting labbaik of your boss as we enter his shrine we are humbled by the intensity of his thirst and the immense rise in your to ensure the survival of the principles and the legacy of the holy prophet's lineage it is a moment that generates a fire within us inspiring us to embrace the same unwavering loyalty and steadfastness in our own lives and to honor his memory by upholding the values of justice courage and selflessness क्या नूर खुदा का बिखरा है हैरान करोड़ों आंखें हैं हर सिद्ध हुसैन का जलवा है हर सिद्ध हुसैन का जलवा है कल जलता हुआ एक सहरा था अब जन्नत का एक टुकड़ा है कल पाक हुसैन अकेला था अब उसके साथ जमाना है जमाना है जो बीत गया जो आएगा हर दौर तुम्हारा हुसैन मौला है हमारा हुसैन हम सब कहनारा हुसैन As the video comes to a close, let us reflect on the significance of this sacred journey to the Haram Ekhun Ekhuda, the Shrine of Divine Blood. It is not a merely a physical pilgrimage, but a spiritual voyage of the soul. It is a reminder that the legacy of Imam Hussain alayhi salam is not confined to history books or the walls of a shrine, and lives on each within and every one of us. I have witnessed people from all walks of life coming together, transcending differences and embracing one another as a brother and sisters. It gives me hope for a better world. As we conclude this video, let us carry the spirit of Haram e Khun e Khuda within us. Let us remember Imam Hussain's unwavering determination to uphold the principles of righteousness and his refusal to bow down to tyranny. Let us honor his sacrifice by embodying his teachings in our actions, in our relationships, and in the pursuit of justice and compassion. May the Haram e Khun e Khuda forever inspire us to be the voices of truth, the defenders of justice, and the barriers of love. And may the memory of Imam Hussain alayhi salam continue to illuminate our paths and guide us towards a world of peace and harmony. Jab bhi aayenge Maula Imam e Zamana, unke labon pe hoga noha Karbala ka, unke labon pe hoga noha Karbala ka. Har dil bezar hoga, shay ka zawar hoga. Har dil bezar hoga. शहर का जवार होगा सारी दुनिया में होगा जिक्र करबला मातम होगा आपका फिर ऐसा या हुसैन मातम होगा आपका फिर ऐसा या हुसैन सारे जहाँ के पर होगा होगा या हुसैन सारे जहाँ के पर होगा होगा या हुसैन होगा जब बेहार ये जमाना या हुसैन सारे जहाँ के पर होगा होगा या हुसैन होता था या हुसैन होता है या हुसैन होता रहेगा या हुसैन या हुसैन हुसैन या हुसैन हुसैन या हुसैन हुसैन या हुसैन या हुसैन शब्बीर के जैसा दुनिया में ना आया था ना आएगा अल्लाह से ऐसा इश्क भला अब करके कौन दिखाएगा موڑا ہے ہمارا موڑا ہے ہمارا